everybody welcome back hope everyone's doing well so look at what happened last night so this happened uh, I don't know what time probably about 9 or 10 o'clock and it just see this this uh, container right here that is our well that branch just missed all of our pipes to our well so my goodness thank God that it did not hit the well because we would have been out of water so whew, thank goodness for that but Unfortunately, our garden did not get fixed this weekend, which is not a big deal. We, um, they just didn't have the right parts at the, at the part store. They, we needed some ball valves and they ran out of ball valves, but they're in now. So hopefully this weekend the garden will be fixed. Um, but tomorrow I'm definitely gonna pot up some tomatoes, some um, tomato seedlings. We have so many, I think about 200 tomato seedlings I counted. So I have no idea where I'm gonna put those at, but let me give you a quick glimpse of the garden. It looks exactly as it did last week. <laughs> Nothing's changed. So, um, but yeah, so that's what I have planned out for tomorrow. Let me just give you a quick glimpse of how everything looks because the seedlings are looking so good. The seedlings that I took out from the napkins, those surprise seedlings, they're growing, so it's awesome. I can't wait to see what kind of seeds they are. Um, the little eggplant, the Kermit eggplant, that one is growing as well. Now the little Thai eggplant, that one is not growing yet. So I don't know. Hopefully, hopefully we might get one. But um, yeah, so that's what's happening right now. And tonight it's supposed to get down to 27 degrees. Tomorrow is supposed to be like 28 and the next day is supposed to be 29. So um, yeah, I'm definitely going to have to... I don't know, figure out what I'm going to do with these, all these seedlings once I get them up potted. But yeah, so let me just give you a quick look at all the seedlings that we have and show you what's popped up. So right here on this top rack, these are the surprise seeds. Look at that. Looking good. And then this one right here are the Kermit's eggplant. And they, every single one of them germinated. So that's awesome. Uh, right here was the Thai eggplant and nothing yet. And then right here is the hibiscus. So we have everything but one. So that's awesome. And then over here on this shelf are some of the tomatoes that I'm gonna be potting up right here. And then down on this shelf as well, here's some more tomatoes right here. These are all the cucumbers looking really good. And then on this bottom rack right here, we have all of our broccoli, um, cauliflower, some peppers, and then at this last one are some cook melons that are doing really well. Awesome. And then over here we have all of the beans and corn. Now eventually, um, once I'm done with, like once I get these seeds out into the garden, I am going to do some succession sowing. So I am going to start another um, set of seedlings so yeah we'll go from there so when i do that i'll definitely show you and take you on i don't know how to do this i'm a total beginner but i did it with my first garden and did the succession sowing and so it's awesome to do because then i get a continuous amount of carrots continuous amount of lettuce and each little flower bit that i have i did i did them one month apart so when i did my fall garden i sowed some carrot seeds and some lettuce seeds in my first bed and then I did another bed with mixed greens and some carrots. And then I did another bed with mixed greens and carrots. And I did them one month after another. So I did one, yeah, one month after another. I think I did one in September, one in October, and one in November. And um, yeah, I, I had no idea that's what I was doing and that's what it was called. And so I was so excited when someone said, oh, so you're succession sewing. And I thought, huh, yeah, I guess I am. <laughs> But yeah, that's how my gardening experience have been going. I, I have no idea what I'm doing. And then when people tell me that I'm doing something right, I get super excited about it. So other than that, that's what's happening on the farm. Um, so yeah, take care, be safe. And tomorrow we're going to up pot some tomatoes. So until then, I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye. Oh, and thank you for watching.